Good morning and happy Tuesday morning to everybody. Today got a few things on the agenda, a lot of odds and ends to get ready for the uh, TV interview tomorrow, uh, various cleaning, I mean I do still clean, uh, get a haircut, things like that to look authentic, but my best authentic tomorrow. Besides that, uh, still strategizing for some lower cost of acquisition for some orders, which is going really well. It's, sales are just snowballing which is fantastic but I think I can find ways to get customers at a lower price point still which is why wouldn't I do that if I have the opportunity topping off some gas right now they're saying because of our hurricane Harvey like tearing up Texas and Houston right now that gas prices are gonna rise 10 or 15 cents a gallon hard to see yet probably will happen I'm guessing in the next coming days and weeks as a lot of the production is in that area Obviously, supply and demand is going to affect the supply, so demand stays the same, price goes up, economics. So, we'll do what we can. And uh, little man cried a little bit, but not crazy today. It was kind of funny this morning before we left. Little lady, of course, is always pretty easy to drop off, but she cried this morning too. Too tired, she said, to get up. Probably only got another 10 or 15 years of that mentality. For one of the kids' things at school, I had to get some pictures printed, so sold by Walgreens for a couple easy photo prints. Busy, busy day, leaving Old Navy, no luck. I was gonna look for some new shorts, maybe on clearance at the end of the season, and not a whole lot of anything left. Probably wear, probably wear jeans for the interview tomorrow, and one of my normal shirts like this. Uh, next off, gotta go to the Charter office, sing so my parents' house, and get a haircut. Busy, busy. Just dropped off my stuff for Charter. They're gonna look into, she was able to contact some local person on the build out for the next house. Hopefully that all gets good, get a reasonable estimate idea, a hard commitment, yes, this is doable, that kind of thing. But now strictly business service from here on out. Uh, next to my parents' house for a quick stop and then haircut. Haircut done, you can see it's a little bit different, a little shorter, a little more cleaned up. Now eat some lunch and I gotta get the basement seriously ready for a TV interview tomorrow for NBC. Ben's been busy down here, got some earbuds going out to Amazon, warehouses in the United States and Canada today. He's back there at his custom made workstation, getting the USA shipment ready. You can kind of see the boxes all packed up here, all going out UPS today. Got some UPS going out today, looks like a total of nine boxes. Oh, with the earbud business, uh, most to Amazon USA and the other to Amazon Canada warehouses. Each one about 1,600 earbuds, 1,600 times nine. I don't know what that is, but whatever that is, that's how many earbuds are going out today. And it's going to be like this for days and weeks to come because everything is just spiraling out of control, snowballing with business, return business, new orders. Nuts. Closing up shop for tonight. Got an email from the Channel 5 NBC reporter. Looks like I have to reschedule for next week, so probably no TV interview tomorrow. A little bummed, but... Next week, it'll happen. Just part of the personal brand journey, I suppose. Business going super, super strong. Uh, looks like maybe email marketing, uh, maybe Facebook ads, but even email marketing plus pushing the personal brand would be the lowest cost of acquisition for new customers. So might have to use that moving forward as best I can. I think I can get the customers cheapest on the dollar on the personal brand and email marketing. See you dark and early, 5 a.m. tomorrow morning.